Okay. No more lies. What happened between you and Graham? What? You heard your man. I told you it was just a mix-up between mates. Is that why your so-called mate had to be dragged off you by Dev and Steve? David, I want the truth. Fine, all right, have it your way. Do you remember the night that I walked Tina home from here? A couple of weeks ago. Yeah, we'd both visited Joe's grave. We talked. Over the bottle of wine. Well, what's that got to do with it? When I got back to Tina's, she let me up. Oh, I'm dreading this already. We had a couple of cans, um, talked about stuff, and uh, it was dead relaxed until... And I seriously don't know what I was thinking. I must have misread the signs or whatever, but I tried to kiss her. She went ballistic, uh, it got weird, and I left. And that's it? Basically. Yes or no? Yes. And am I right in assuming that Tina told Graham, hence this fight? Yeah, I guess. Well, I don't understand. All this animosity over a kiss? No, not exactly. You see, Graham has got it into his head that I tried to rape Tina, but I swear on Bethany's life, it never, never even came close to that. All right? You just got to believe me. I am not that person. I admit it was wrong of me to make a move on Tina, but sh she's blown this all out of proportion. I'm not finished with you. I'm really scared. It's the police. David Platt. I'm arresting you on suspicion of the attempted murder of Graham Proctor. 